this building that you see here and which is located right across the street from the International Airport in Avarua, the capital of Rarotonga, this building is the parliament of the Cook Islands. Not a very remarkable building from an architectural perspective. Let's get a little closer. Now this building was built in the, uh, 19, the late 1960s to house the, cons the construction crews that were building the International Airport. So it was actually a hotel or a hostel of some kind. And uh, after the construction of the airport was completed, it was turned into a parliament building. There are plans, however, for a brand new, beautiful building to be constructed within the next few years. Now, we have special permission to go inside this building. And I will show you all the main parts and we're going to, to also visit believe it or not, the chamber where the parliament meets and we're going to learn a few things about the parliament of the Cook Islands. So let's go through the entrance and let's go for a tour. As soon as you enter the building on the left, you would find this cafeteria and this is where the members of parliament have breakfast and lunch and their meals not a very large room you see the kitchen behind that uh, window there and pictures of various politicians up there on the walls Here's the last view. Okay, and this is the chamber where the parliament meets. And let's take a very quick tour. Here on my left is where the public would sit to attend the hearings. And there are 24 members of parliament elected for a four year term. 10 would come from Rarotonga and the other 14 from uh, the various islands from the north and the south group of islands for a total of 24 members. This uh, seat here in the center, you see three seats here. This is where he, the prime minister would sit. In the center of the chamber is the party that has won the majority. And on the right is the opposition currently nine members of parliament. Now walking forward, there's a seat that you see up there, and that's the seat of the speaker of the parliament. Let's walk around this way so we can get a better view. And of course, to her left would be the opposition right there. And right above the seat, of the Speaker of the Parliament, would, you would see a picture of Queen Elizabeth II. Here's another view of this very historic room here in the Parliament House of the Cook Islands in Rarotonga. What a wonderful experience and a privilege to be able to come in here and videotape this room. Let's go look at the other places of this building. Okay, let's enter once again. Here's the cafeteria to my left that we just saw. Here's the chamber where the parliament meets. And if we make a turn, we're going to see three pictures here of Queen Elizabeth II, who is the head of government, and two the two pictures on the left are previous QRs, Queen Representatives. 
I represent Queen Elizabeth here in the Cook Islands. Here is the long room of the parliament. To my left is the office of the prime minister and this is where the prime minister would sit if he visited the building. And there's a variety of offices left and right. On my right I'm passing the library. Here's a conference room here. Now you're not going to find offices here for each members of the parliament. Each party has its own building outside this establishment here. This is that's the building where they meet. But if there is a meeting, this is where the opposition members of the opposition would come and discuss matters. And this is the end of the building. Right here, let's take another view. It has been a real privilege to be able to come in here and show you this building. <laughs>